What's going on everybody, this is Albert Castle from Vapor Nation bringing you yet another juice review. Today is the first installment of Wet Wick Wednesday. Let's get it. Alright, so today we're going to be reviewing um, probably arguably one of the biggest e-juice companies around right now for premium e-juice and I reviewed one of their juices before I'm just gonna fucking say their name they're called Cutwood everybody this is this is Cutwood today we're gonna be reviewing their Sugar Drizzle formerly known as Sugar Bear and their Bird Brains I have reviewed their Unicorn Milk if you wanna go check that out I did get some shit from some guy on that video though I mean I respect your comments and everything and I appreciate them um, but he, he gave me some some lip because I gave my own opinion. I didn't read an actual flavor description on the juice. And uh, he got mad because I failed to mention that there are four cream flavors in the juice or some shit. So I got a lot of shit for that. But um, other than that, you can go check that out. Um if you see that guy's comment in there, I don't know if I deleted it or not, but if you see it, um, give him the business, you know, because he kind of hurt my feelings. But today we're going to be talking about these two juices. I picked them up at Super Vape Alhambra, located in Alhambra, California. Check them out on Instagram. I'm going to leave their Instagram below. I'm really thinking about um, taking my actual camera to their shop and showing you guys what an amazing shop this is. And it's it's such an amazing shop. They got so much juice. And I've actually posted a picture of all the juices. Well, it was like maybe a quarter of all the juices that they actually have on my Instagram. I'm going to leave that below as well. If you want to follow me on there, that would be cool. I'm really we're going to start working on a giveaway. Maybe an Instagram. Maybe separate. Maybe an Instagram giveaway and a YouTube giveaway. Um, who knows? It's in the works. So just bear with me. I'm going to have some of my fancy juice. It's just Coke. All right. So I want to start vaping because I just woke up. I just got out of the shower. My hair is down. Deal with it. I'm sorry. I know I'm not cute at this point. <laughs> but I need to vape. So good. All right. So the first juice we're going to talk about is their sugar drizzle. I'm sure you guys can see that. Sugar drizzle. I'm sorry you can see the reflection of the GoPro light on the bottle. I have the flavor description here, and from now on, from in all of my juice reviews, I'm going to read a flavor description because I don't want any um, negative comments just because I give my own opinion on the flavor of a juice. So I'm going to read the actual flavor first, and then I'm going to let you know what I taste. But before I do that, I'm going to take one more vape. I'm going to take one more vape. So good. So good. All right. So this is actually off of www.cutwood.com. I don't know why I said www. Nobody says that shit anymore. Sugar drizzle. <laughs> An expert balance of cinnamon bakery meets sweet milky cream to create a very all-day vapable e-sauce. Not e-juice, e-sauce. That hits those breakfast cereal notes your taste buds crave. Pretty solid description, I would say. But I'm going to give my own opinion in just a second. All right. To me, this juice tastes exactly like a churro. Like a fucking churro. And I know I'm Hispanic and I'm saying it like a um, Caucasian male. <laughs> but um, I'm literally the whitest Mexican you'll ever be. Like, I, I, I speak little to no Spanish. The only Spanish I've ever learned was working at a restaurant. Working in the back of the restaurant, actually. Because <laughs> all the cooks and everyone that works in the back is Hispanic. So, that's where I learned uh, poquito espanol. But this flavor, um, I'm getting a little off topic here. 
this flavor is really solid. It has a nice, not too strong of a cinnamon base to it. Like, that's what the base of it is. A very nice and sweet cinnamon flavor. And on the exhale, there is a slight creaminess. It's not super pungent. It doesn't stand out too much. But it's there. It's definitely there. As you can see, the vapor is kicking on it. I'm running a 0 0.19 ohm coil at 60 watts at a, on, on two freshly charged VTC4s. So I'm getting some pretty great power out of this. Ooh. If you see me looking down or looking down here it's because I think I mentioned in my last video I can actually see myself on my phone here which is kinda cool GoPro has its has its perks I'll tell you that much but I it kinda makes up for not being able to see the front you know not having a front faced camera screen it does have a front faced camera just a front face screen alright so I'm gonna take one more uh, vape off of this sugar drizzle just to get my wicks all cleared off solid man definitely something I've been vaping a lot I picked this up like I want to say it's about two days ago and I've I've already gotten down to about half the bottle and I I've been just keep in mind I have all this other juice that I've been vaping as well so you know you know I'm vaping this a lot the next one we're gonna review this is gonna be the final one of wet wick Wednesday episode one this one is going to be their bird brains both of these juices are 6 milligrams, you already know, little old me. I like my 6 milligram juices. And uh, I have the flavor description here, I'm going to read that in just a second. But before I do that, I'm going to put some juice on my cotton. Man, that sugar drizzle is just lingering on my taste buds. I dig it. I dig it a lot. Alright. So that's all set. Oh, this is a small... Small little description. So this is Bird Brains, a fresh out-of-the-box fruit cereal that delivers true on every note. Short, sweet, and to the point. I dig it, Cutwood. I dig it. If you're watching this, sponsor me. <laughs> All right, so this is their Bird Brains. It's always a little difficult to distinguish flavors right after I put a juice onto a, a wet wick that has already had a previous juice on it. So just give me a second here. Get my taste buds on point. Get my taste buds on fleek. Okay. Alright, that's getting a little better. Jesus, it's getting a little much in my lungs. Okay, sorry, my hair is all crazy right now. All right, so the flavor on the bird brains. It honestly tastes like every other cereal flavor I've ever had, ever. Very close and reminiscent of Kilo's cereal milk that I just reviewed. It's my last video I think I just put up. Very reminiscent. However, the Bird Brains, I feel, has a more fruity flavor to it than creamy. Um, although, they do not say that there is milk in it. It just says fruit cereal. So, that's expected, I would assume. That it is more of a fruity flavor than a creamy flavor. Great vapor production off of the both of these. Um, it doesn't say that it is. No, it doesn't have a PG to BG ratio, but I want to guess it's probably 
a 70 30 maybe an 80 20 i don't i really don't think it's a 50 50 blend i really don't but yeah that pretty much wraps it up um again this was bird brains and sugar drizzle by cutwood solid company they they are obviously the biggest juice company for a reason all their juices are really good and uh no complaints on either one of these no complaints at all so that about wraps it up for wet wick wednesday i hope you guys enjoyed this little series that i'm going to start i am going to continue to do this as long as i can and i hope you guys stick around and hopefully we can we can do some more of these Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. If you guys can leave a like or even subscribe if you can, that would be great. Um, I'm trying to post as much content as possible. I don't want to oversaturate anything, though. That's that's for sure. So thank you guys for sticking around. I'm, again, I'm going to leave my Instagram and Super Vape Alhambra's Instagram down below. If you can follow us, that would be great. And uh, thank you guys. I really appreciate it. This is Albert Cash from Vapor Nation signing off. Until next time. Vape on.